What's up guys, welcome to my channel. You guys asked for it, so today we are going to be going over what's inside my baseball bag. Um, but before we get started, make sure you guys subscribe, like, comment, and share this channel. I really do appreciate all the support, and you guys have really helped the channel grow and mean a lot to me. So, before we get into the video, Rocky, my super sweet Roto, Roto wear shirt. I don't know how to pronounce it, but big fan. If you guys haven't checked them out, they have a lot of different baseball shirts and other sports. So, to begin, I don't have a baseball bag. I have a Lululemon travel bag, um, and it's honestly awesome because it has like endless pockets. Uh, it's pretty light, and you can, it's like a Mary Poppins bag. I have all my baseball stuff in it, um, and it works out great. So, I don't really have a baseball bag, but this is, best uh, best bag I've ever had so shout out Lulu so there's like four different compartments and endless pockets which makes it great to organize stuff so we'll move this over to start I have my baseball glove it is a Rawlings pro preferred um, I've had this almost three years now and I'm actually looking to get a new glove so leave your comment on whether you prefer Rawlings or Wilson or any other company, but I do love this glove. This is my baby. Um, I have some writing on it, and yeah, it means a lot to me. Oops, leave that right there. Next, Jager Bands. So my agency sent me these after I told them I didn't have any in the YouTube video, so shout out to them. I don't know why they sent me orange, um, but I'm still working to break these in, so they're uh, used in my warm-up program every day. So, uh, next, we have not Jager bands, but other bands. Um, I use these for recovery and mostly use them as backup bands in case I ever forget my Jager bands. So, we got a rosin bag, mostly for uh, once I actually start throwing bullpens again. The bag doesn't close, so I'm not gonna, not gonna throw this one. Next, and very important, um, my driveline plyo balls. So I use these every day I throw um, as part of my warm up. Don't ask me what my plyo ball routine is. It's in my YouTube, just watch the video. Plyo balls are an awesome tool. And here's my full set of driveline plyo balls. All right, so that is that pocket. I kind of get lost sometimes in the bag. Um, so the next pocket is where I keep all my baseballs. So we have our regulation, have one nice baseball left, um, which won't last very long. So I have my regular baseballs. And then I also have all of my driveline weighted leather baseballs. So we got our nine ounce, seven ounce, somewhere in here we have our four ounce, six ounce, and 11 ounce. So, Sometimes I'll use these for long toss um, or just catch to kind of get loose. So along with driveline uh, baseballs, I also have our clean Fuego tools. So it's like a baseball, but it's cut in half. And so these are to work on spin efficiency. Um, you kind of throw them. This is a weighted one, eight ounce. This is a five ounce. Uh, shout out to Clean Fuego for sending me these. And I really like them a lot for spin efficiency, making sure your ball doesn't wobble. Um, and getting that good vertical break. So now we start getting into the side pockets. Pocket radar, big time. Uh, very grateful they sent me this. I used it all off season to track my velo. Because again, if you don't know how hard you're throwing, it's very hard to actually track it. So pocket radar, big essential for pitchers and any player. We also have our pocket radar stand. So this is where we get into other stuff. Caffeine pills. Some days you need it. You know, not every day. Icy hot. Baseball players know. The peanut. Um, it's like a lacrosse ball for rolling out um, deep tissue work. So I usually do this before I throw workouts, stuff like that. So good tool. Also very important is called Foot Duster. It is a foot deodorant. Um, it's from Manscaped and it's by far the best I've found because 
throwing or working out, my shoes do not smell good. So I've always had to burn through shoes. So now with this rap bear workout, I just spray it in. So I'll keep it in my bag and spray it in my cleats and they have lasted much longer and smell a lot better. Boy, that sure sounds good. So definitely a plus if you know what I'm talking about. So now we continue on to some things that aren't always in my baseball bag, but that are essential. My Theragun. So I like to use this for warm-ups, uh, post-throwing, mostly just because it feels really good. So it has a bunch of different like attachments. Um, I use it on my arm, my shoulder, stuff like that. I use it on my back a lot. Um, and it's definitely a good tool to help you get loose and recover. Next, out of my bag, we have our driveline trampoline. So this is used for recovery, uh, doing rebounders, it doesn't fit in my bag, um, but I do bring it in my car or to the field with me. It's also very good for you and the boys to play some spike ball with plyo balls in your bullpen before games. If you get in trouble for that, that's not on me. So. These are my current cleats. These are Under Armour Rice Harpers. Um, these are extremely dirty, so I'm not gonna like throw them or put them down. But they've been really good uh, training cleats. They've held up well. Uh, pretty nice. They're the first Under Armors I've ever had. I'm usually a Nike or New Balance guy, so these won't probably make it to season. These uh, are a little bit worn down. Basketball shoes for throwing indoors on mounds. Basketball shoes are by far the best shoes for throwing indoors, off mounds, stuff like that. Um, you don't destroy them with your toe drag, and they honestly look better too. So definitely recommend these. Um, I like higher ankle support and think that these are super important for throwing indoors. <laughs> and we missed! <laughs> so, the last thing that I'm very excited about um, are these newly custom cleats I got. So, these our basketball shoes, um, they're New Balance. I believe they're the first line of New Balance basketball shoes. And as you can see, I got them cleated, got tough toe, and again, A's, we wear all white cleats. And so, I mean, they're gonna get dirty, and I know that, and it's okay. Um, but I am very excited to actually wear these um, for some live ABs in some future videos. So, these are my cleats of the year and gonna be my game day ones, and then I'll have another pair uh, for practice, but super stoked to wear these. Awesome, well I appreciate you guys watching what's in my baseball bag and all the baseball gear I use. Um, so don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and share this video, but also drop in the comment and rate this video from zero to 6.9, and let me know what you guys thought, but I appreciate you for watching.